Hey guys, this is a Tamanaka Collective. I just wanted to give you a quick update so I can keep consistent with some videos. And I wanted you to look at the uh, start of my aeroponic system. And in order to use the aeroponic system, you have to get some plants started. Because you can't really start them in the system that I know of. So I've got some peppers and basil and lettuce and arugula and a few other fun little plants. And that's on side with a different project, which is this one. And this one is um, pepper. So I have some chili de agua that I just germinated. And you can see them there. And in the far back, you can see some cayenne peppers, which have also started germinating. And I'm going to throw these guys in pots. And they will grow inside the greenhouse, but they're not related to the aeroponics. However, I have grown them hydroponically, and they've been doing wonderful with that before. So anyway, these are the plants that are going in the hydroponic, the aeroponic system. And we have basil already sprouted. And we have something called a sensitive plant, which is a briar, which is going to be kind of fun. I just thought I would do it, uh, but it's not really something you would eat. And then we have some lettuce growing, you can see. And our spinach and arugula are starting to pop up already. And uh, I think that's going to be fun. In the next several days, I'm going to start populating the... Uh, pyramids that you saw with the these plants and uh, we'll see what happens by the way these are LED lights that I myself built out of Cree LED emitters while I was trying to learn how LED lights worked and they do just fine these uh, are in mats so they're heated and so it does raise the temperature up and I really appreciate that that's really cool and uh, I use these guys let's see let me see if I can dig one out they're a coconut base brownie, and uh, they're pretty fun. I use them. They're kind of spendy, so I don't like do it on everything. Like if I were to go in my garden where I have my quarter acre plot, I won't use those to start. I'll just use soil. But for hydroponics projects, I love using these. I don't like using rock wool because rock wool has silica in it, and it's not really biodegradable. They just all sit there, and these will just tear apart, and they're really easily shreddable, and, and then they just fall apart anyway. So, uh, I'll uh, update you guys when I put these in, and uh, I hope you've been enjoying my videos. Please comment or subscribe, and uh, I'll see you guys later.